everybody, this is part two of how to apply gel over wraps. In my last video, I showed how to select accent nails and also how to apply your wrap um, in a real quick manner. So we um, got our wrap put on, we did it really quickly, and now I am going to transition to putting the gel. So to do this, you'll need your gel kit. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and re-alcohol wipe the wraps that I'm gonna apply the gel to. And that's just to get any, um, you know, you were pushing down on your wraps when you applied them and your fingers have oils in them and we don't want oil on the wraps before we apply. Now, um, when you apply the gel over wraps, all you need to do is apply your wraps as normal as you saw in the other video. And now um, I'm gonna apply the base coat first. You wanna shake it up really good. And then I have my Jamberry um, LED light. Um, and I'm going to, you can see the gel base coat is first and it's just kind of like a thick um, nail polish uh, is what it looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply thin layers, or I should say layer, right over the wrap. And if a little bit of my nail is showing, I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that gets it too. And if you have long nails, if you have short nails, I wouldn't bother with this step. You can kind of cap off the wrap and the nail together there. All right, and then the last thing with your orange stick, you wanna make sure that you kind of like, just go around your nail to get off any excess of the gel because it, once you put it in the light, it cures and it's gonna be hard as a rock, okay? So now my next step, and let me get my light out here, is I'm gonna stick the nail, and actually I can do this at the same time. Let me go ahead and do the other nail. So we'll save time. When you're doing your whole hand, this step, I mean all the steps to putting the gel on your wraps takes like five minutes total. And so you would um, go ahead and put the base coat on. We're going to stick it in the light. The light has a timer and it's 45 seconds and it just tells you um, when the curing's over. Um, some people ask like if you have a lamp already can you use it with Jamberry's base and top coat or vice versa can you use a base and top coat that you have with Jamberry's light. Um, and the answer from uh, chemists that we have on our team is it's not a good idea because um, the light and the like wave frequencies or whatever are formulated specially to Jamberry's formulas and others are the same way. So it's probably not a great idea to mix and match brands. Okay, the light went off. That means it's all cured and now I'm gonna Go ahead and go to my top coat. Shake it up just like before. You don't need to alcohol wipe in between the base and the top coat. The top coat's gonna be even thicker than the base coat, and you wanna do thin layers. If you do too thick, it will look um, kind, you'll be, it'll get kind of milky or foggy looking. Um, so, yeah, just be, you know, wipe off. You don't need a ton of product, which is great because it'll last you so long, so many applications in just one little bottle. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do my other accent nail. This is looking awesome. I love the black and white stripe. I love the shine of the True Shine Gel. It's just really cool. All right, that looks great. Make sure you get any excess off because you don't want it to cure too thick. All right, and then I'm using my orange stick to kind of get off any extra top coat. Kind of, there we go, wipe that off. And we're gonna go ahead and go to our cure light again. We'll stick our fingers in for 45 more seconds. And when you do this on your whole hand, you'll do your four fingers at one time on one hand, and then you'll do your four fingers on your other hand, and then you'll do your thumbs together. So that's 45 seconds times three, and then that's the curing for a base, and then you would do that again for top coat. So that's why it really only takes, I guess technically it'd be a slightly more than five minutes to do the gel um, over your wraps. It's so fast. <laughs> and it's really cool. So after the light goes off, it's gonna go off here in just a second, 
Um, the next thing you want to have ready to go is an alcohol wipe. Um, what I didn't know, because I wasn't really a gel person before this came out, um, is that now there's like a sticky surface and I was all worried at first like, oh, it didn't cure, it's not drying. And um, There's no dry time with gel. I'm not sure if you guys knew that or not. Um, you never have to wait for it to um, dry. Do you see what I just did? I just totally wiped my nail and some of you are probably like, oh! nope, it's totally cured. It's hard as a rock and the gel you just wipe right off and, um, and then your nail has that awesome gel finish. It's uh, thicker, kind of adds a little bit of thickness to your nail, which I think is nice. A lot of people who love gel nails really like the thickness. Um, it's got the shine that you're looking for and the durability that if you've ever had problems with your wraps lifting on the edges you know just because you're really rough on your fingers or you had application problems the gel is going to really help you get that nice clean finish and it's gonna stay that way until you take your wraps off it's great all right you guys in the comments, write any questions that you might have, or if you want to see me do a, a demo of another product or a different combination of wraps and lacquer or, or wrap over wrap, then let me know and I'd be happy to show you. All right, you guys have a great week. Bye.